All right, fourth take. Hey everyone, my name is Ram. Welcome to another live commentary. Today is March 11th, 2024. It is two days after the last live commentary, and I have some pretty bad news. Uh, before we get into the bad news, I want to say uh, thank you to the comment of the day from Arnie, who asked if I could do a Minecraft hardcore series. No, I am really bad at Minecraft, and having a hardcore series as someone who's bad at Minecraft is really just you guys looking at different seeds, to be honest with you. So I, I'm not gonna do that. I'm not gonna put myself, nor am I gonna put you guys through the torture of watching uh, me play hardcore Minecraft. But anywho, let's get back onto the main topic of the video. And it's a quick one, I wanna make it quick. And that is a couple of things. First thing, and most important thing, Mercury, the website that I used to manage my channel, to manage the descriptions, to manage tagging, and more importantly, to manage the banner and the shout outs for every week, is currently shutting down. And this is prob problematic for two reasons. The first reason is because, well, I really don't know much about graphic design to make a new banner. And two, my one way to connect with you guys is unfortunately gone. Now, I do still have comments of the days, as you guys just seen, but not everyone will get comment of the day. You know, sometimes I'll have like 10 comments from a video and I could really only choose one of those comments to respond. And I usually choose comments of the day by one of three things, because it pushed the conversation forward. Did it give the idea to the video or is it recent? I'm not going to respond to a four week old comment from, you know, a video that I uploaded two or three months ago, which believe me, people are still commenting on some of my videos uh, from back in like November. And I'm okay with that. However, I don't think those comments are worth being commented of the day because they're saying stuff that I either already know or stuff that I already clarified or, you know, something that. I'm just like, if I respond to this comment now, it's pointless. So yeah, the, the one way that I have to connect with you guys through video format is sort of gone and that kind of sucks. Uh, banner as well to show you guys where our milestones are and where we are going from where we're at now to where we want to be is gone as well. Uh, I used to have the milestones up on top of the banner and I would have it live update with all the subscribers that we got. Usually it take a refresh or two on the website in order to um, show where we were at. But by at least an hour, you guys would see the live version of our uh, channel. And now it's gone. And that really sucks, especially since uh, if you follow my Instagram, I show our progress pics from when we first started the channel to the end of the year to where we were uh, whenever we hit a milestone. Bummer, a real big bummer, I'm not gonna lie to you guys. So that, that's that gone and it sucks, but whatever. I, I mean, I'm stuck on it mentally and I'm gonna do better with the content that we have now and with the content that we're going on forward. So with the banner being changed, I actually, or with the banner being shut down, really, I went ahead and changed it myself. Uh, I'm not sure if you guys like it yet or not. I'm not really fully set on the design. Uh, it's supposed to be a glass of soda, uh, which I know it doesn't really come through great. Uh, I'll be honest with you guys. Graphic design is not my passion. <laughs> it is not my passion at all. Uh, I'm a writer, I'm a video editor, I am not a graphic designer whatsoever. I'm not even close to it. So, it's a little, I know, ugly, and I'm sure I'll change it later, uh, but for now that's what we got. Uh, I tried looking for someone that could have like the sense of style that I wanted, and I just, I couldn't find it, unfortunately, and I would have paid, I don't know, like. 40 bucks or something for it but nah it it's whatever we'll look at into it we'll look into it more in the future but right now that's what we have and to make it so that way it's less jarring i went ahead and also changed our channel profile picture 
and that's because I feel like if I kept the old profile picture, it would be way too uh, weird and like it doesn't match at all with the banner like the last one did. The last two actually matched with each other. So I felt like I might as well make these two match as well. So yeah, I went ahead, changed the profile picture, changed the banner. Uh, descriptions are changing slowly. I already have on the Fortnite video, that one um, has the changed description. Uh, tagging as well is going to be a little different. I might get more views. I might not. I might get less views actually on my videos because of it. Uh, because I'm still kind of new to tagging. I never really understood it. Still don't quite understand it. But um, yeah, you know, it's, we'll go through it you know, as we grow. And that's that with Mercury. And we did that within sub five minutes. So now we can talk about the other thing, which was why did I lie on my last live commentary? I said I wasn't going to upload a Fortnite video. Uh, peer pressure is the answer. Uh, my friends were not really peer pressuring me like I'm saying it is. But my friends did recommend to me a lot of times that, hey, you're not making any battle bit content. You might as well make content of the games that you're playing currently. And at the time, what I'm playing is Fortnite. So I decided to record a couple of games that we played together. Uh, by no means is that the best one, but it's still a fun video to watch anyways, since, you know, you could see us just being like dumb. And I did a little bit of a different editing style there as well. Uh, a lot of censoring, which typically I don't do. And the main reason I don't censor myself is because I feel like I don't want to censor myself. I think censoring myself shows that my content's kind of for kids. So you might be wondering why I did it for the Fortnite video. And the reason why isn't because, oh, I wanted to appeal to a younger audience. It's really just because I thought it was funny. Like it, in all honesty, I thought it was funnier with the censoring, with the censoring, with the uh, chug splash noise. You know, I, I don't want to like take away from what I'm already doing uh, with censorship or anything like that. And not only that, I know in the future, myself, if I make money on YouTube, I know my future self will be thankful because I know that YouTube has a little bit of a problem when it comes to uh, demonetizing old videos and you know, striking your channel or something like that, giving you warnings uh, for content that used to be okay, but now it's not. So yeah, I'm sure my future self will thank me for that kind of censorship video. And to be fair, I try not to curse in live commentaries. Uh, a couple will slip out. And I feel like that couple is fine. But if it gets like too much, then I typically don't upload that take. I'll probably delete it, actually. Uh, I'll take it down, redo it, and try to say what I can with a clear mind and a less sailory tongue. But um, yeah, I guess that's really it's i mean i wanted this to be very quick um i didn't want this to take too long and i know that a lot of people would rather have quick, faster content than uh longer content anyways so it was you know i think it, i think it fits pretty well with everyone um uh, hopefully next time i have better news i know today's news wasn't great but know what can i do so with that all that being said my name's rum guys i hope you guys have a good day bye, -bye.